I'm doing this. I guess I'm doing this. Hey everyone, it's me, Hema, and welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm going to be waking up every day for a week at 6 o'clock. What? We're going to force ourselves to wake up tomorrow. We are. 6 a.m. What the fuck? Reasons why I'm putting myself through this torture. For one, I need to reset my very messed up sleep cycle ever since I flew back to Singapore. I have not been able to sleep till like 2 a.m. And then waking up is a terrible nightmare. So that. Secondly, I'm going to start work soon. So I need to be getting up around 6 o'clock every day. Anyways, it's currently 11.35. So I'm already setting myself up for failure. But we're going to wake up at 6 tomorrow. Because because. We are. Just do it! I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. My voice is very low and deep at the moment. I think it's like 6.20. I'm actually not tired. It wasn't hard to wake up to the alarm. My body automatically kind of woke up around like 5.50. I really was anticipating this. I made myself a cup of coffee just to kickstart the day. I'm not sure how many cups of coffee I'm gonna need to stay awake, but it's still dark outside. I hate waking up when it's dark outside. And the sun doesn't rise super early in Singapore. I think the sunrise is like 7.15 today. So I've got an hour to waste. Not to waste, we're gonna be productive. Be productive. Or try to be at least in day one. I'm gonna do some things on my computer. Then I'm gonna go for a run. I feel like going for a run. If you don't see me again in my workout gear, means I'm probably not going for a run. I'm tired. See you in a bit. After my run, I had to drop my mom off at work and on the way back home, I was a little cheeky and went for McDonald's drive through and got myself some breakfast. Thank you. Just got out of the shower and I look like a crazy person now because my hair is so wet. Look up a turban on my head. I am so hungry, so I can't wait for my head to dry to eat. I got the big deluxe from McDonald's because go big or go home, baby. I'm not really setting a good example by working out and then eating McDonald's, but pretty proud of myself for what I've done this morning. So I needed to treat myself, okay? It's like heaven in a plate. Mm, I'm so happy. Oh. I started the morning with my usual morning routine things. I took some time to do a little morning meditation and organize my plans for the rest of the week. I spent the rest of the day at home relaxing and taking time for myself. Day three, going strong. I did struggle to get up this morning. I think I lay in bed for about 15 minutes before I got up. Even though I did go to bed early, I kept waking up in the middle of the night for some reason. I do feel more exhausted this morning than usual. I'm looking a bit more presentable today because I'm going out with my friend. So I have a very long day out ahead of me. So hopefully I don't get too exhausted. But yeah, so far not too bad. 
My friend and I caught up for lunch and we decided to go thrift shopping. I actually managed to get some really good finds, so I was really happy with my trip. After shopping, we went to check out the Singapore Art Museum exhibitions for the Singapore Art Week. After which, we decided to go to a cafe and get something to drink. And this is where it all went south. Um, as you can tell, the sun is already up. I woke up an hour later and I'm exhausted. I think the only reason why like, I couldn't wake up and I was super exhausted was the fact that I slept very late last night. Yeah, less than six hours of sleep is just a no go. Like, my body doesn't function. So, I couldn't wake up. It's okay, because I still woke up at seven and I'm not gonna beat myself up for it. As long as I am well rested, I think that's more important than waking up at 6 a.m. Um, especially because I can afford to wake up an hour later now. Hello, I just got back home and took a really quick shower. I went to go get my brows threaded. They look pretty snatched now, I think. I made myself some afternoon tea. I just wanted to give like a quick update of how I've been feeling kind of the past few days. So far, I have been loving waking up super early in the morning and I feel that I can be more productive in the mornings. I somehow have more energy to exercise and just get work done. I woke up at 7 a.m. this morning. I was so tired, guys. And in all honesty, all the days that I do sleep early, I can wake up at 6 without a problem. What I've been feeling so far is kind of every day and around like the midday mark when it's about noon time, I'm quite tired and especially after lunch the food coma just sets in and I feel really really exhausted My afternoon teas are not enough By 8 o'clock I really want to sleep, I want to go to bed I would notice myself needing like a 20 minute power nap or a 1 hour nap in the afternoon which is not good at all Another major symptom that I'm seeing and to be honest it took me a while to kind of correlate this and that is that I've been feeling not too well basically think the overall exhaustion is kind of wearing down my body and making my body feel a bit sickly if that makes sense which is kind of surprising to me because I don't usually get sick throughout the year but I think the drastic change really took a toll on me I am gonna do my very very best to sleep at about 10.30 or 11 today so that I can get a good 7, 7.5 hours of sleep and hopefully I'll be back on track tomorrow with waking up at 6 a.m. I think something that has helped me to stay motivated with waking up early every morning is by establishing a very simple and structured routine to follow once I wake up. My mornings always start with a cup of coffee, meditation, some time for journaling and breakfast. I've also been blocking an hour every morning to get on top of my Spanish language practices. Completing all these little tasks makes me feel very productive in the mornings and gets my engines running for the rest of the day. On Saturday, I caught up with a friend over brunch and I pretty much spent my entire day and evening catching up with friends. And finally, we made it to Sunday. Sunday was pretty boring. I stayed in for the most part and just recharged for the next week. I also started editing this video that you're watching right now. Even though this week started off pretty rough, I gotta admit that waking up early wasn't all bad. In fact, I loved having the extra time in the mornings and I felt more productive, happy and accomplished by midday. I'm gonna try and keep this going, maybe not 6am every day, 
maybe 6.30, 6.45. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was enjoyable and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!